Now that all those shenanigans with Sonic and Robotnik are over, I can finally take some time to myself and get back to my true purpose. Guarding the last artifact of my ancestors. And defending the grounds that my people once called home. It's not always easy. I have to be vigilant. Always on high alert. But I mean, admittedly, the job does also have its perks. Huh. Angel Island is home to incredible wildlife. The breeze is always calm, and the clouds always clutter the sky overhead. But, even with all this being the case, why do I still feel so... unhappy? Is all of this really my sole responsibility? Or is it the responsibility that my forefathers always envisioned for me? I am the last of the Akinda tribe, after all. No one else is around to preserve what's been left behind. But is this what they wanted? For me to sit around all day doing... nothing? I'm fulfilling a role, yes. But I'm not necessarily doing what most would consider... fun. It's undeniable that Angel Island is beautiful. It always has been since the moment I was born. I understand its importance, but... I just... No, I need to stay focused and stop thinking about this so hard. I'm definitely not the smartest anyway. Maybe this is the only thing I could ever be good at. Although, I was good at giving Sonic and Tails a run for their money. It still stings that Robotic fooled me, but... Uh, I can't say that the whole ordeal wasn't a fun time. In a way. I may have been wrong about those two. But no doubt in my mind that they'll find themselves in trouble again. Someday. And when that happens, I better make sure I'm around to help out. Next time, I'll redeem my honor as an echidna warrior and fight for the side of justice and freedom. Knowing Sonic, he'll for sure need someone like me for support. My combat skills are unmatched. I'm sure the Master Emerald would be okay with me giving myself a day off every so often.